Based on the presence or absence of A and B antigens on the surfaces of red blood cells, human blood can be categorized into four broad types, O, A, B, and AB, and further into positive and negative based on the presence of D antigen. Before blood transfusions can be performed, determining the blood type is essential, as transfusion of non-matching blood type can result in blood agglutination. Traditional blood typing tests use antibodies to determine the presence of these antigens. However, these tests are expensive, non-portable, and time-consuming, proving to be problematic in emergency situations. To overcome this issue, Dr. Masahiro Motosuke and his team at Tokyo University of Science have developed a compact and rapid blood group analysis chip for whole blood, which contains a micro-sized laboratory with three main segments, the diluter, the homogenizer, and the testing chambers. To start with, a user inserts a small amount of blood and presses a button. The blood is first diluted in the diluter with a saline solution, with air bubbles injected to promote mixing. Then, this blood saline solution flows into the homogenizer, which facilitates further mixing, yielding a uniform solution. Once the solution has been fully mixed, air is squeezed into the waste chamber and the liquid flows into four detectors, which consist of a reaction chamber and an agglutination capturing slit. Three of these detectors are preloaded with reagents designed to detect which antigens the blood contains, A, B, and D, with the fourth containing only saline, acting as a control. Once the blood reacts with the reagents, it agglutinates and then collects in the agglutination slits, where a medical professional can use the naked eye to determine the blood type. This novel device is highly accurate and can yield results within five minutes six times faster than traditional methods. It can be used by medical staff in emergency rooms to determine the blood type of trauma patients within minutes, saving time and increasing patient survival rates, as well as saving costs on expensive equipment.